Hi everyone, so I have some happy mail to share with you guys. I forgot to share this card back in January. This is a birthday card for Sunny. And this came from Shell, and they actually share the same birthday. And she sent him this beautiful little piggy card. So we are going to glue it into his pig junk journal. I still need to share that with you guys. I still have a long list of things I need to share with you guys. Um, and that's one of them. So this card is just beautiful and i love that it has like boy vibes it's not pink because most of the time we see pigs they're pink so i just love it and so did he and then it's just stamped on the inside as well such a beautiful card and she stamped all the little piggies like even down on the edge over here you can see all the little piggies it's just a gorgeous gorgeous card and he loves it and I had to fight him to let me share it on video and promise to give it back to him so yes that was from january from shell thank you so much for sending sunny a birthday card and a happy belated birthday to you i sure i told you happy birthday back then but happy birthday again and then we got some other mail this comes from my friend wanda she's over at a day in my world and then these came last week i think it was so these are valentine's day cards let me show you what we got here this one comes from jennifer let me get the card out here so we have the beautiful little die cut from AliExpress. It's a little kissing booth. And then she sent me a bunch of little die cuts in here, which I love. Look at this one. Isn't this one gorgeous? Look at those roses. And then on that foil paper, it's just stunning. And then we have the little wreath right here of roses. And then we have some embossed lacy little paper right here. So um, she just sent me a little note that she was so proud that I didn't buy the kissing booth from Hobby Lobby. So she made me and sent me a little kissing booth, which I really, really appreciate. Thank you so, so much. Yes, I did not buy the kissing booth from Hobby Lobby. And trust me, it still haunts me to this day that I didn't go out and get it. <laughs> It was just so pretty. I should have got it. But I, like I said, I'm trying to cut down on my spending because I have no room for anything anymore. So the little kissy booth stayed at Hobby Lobby. And then here is the next little card right here. You guys know I'm a sucker for a shaker. So I absolutely love this one. And this one comes from Karen. And I love that she did a little heart and it says galentine but this looks like homemade paper in the background with you see like the little fibers to it i just think it's absolutely beautiful so she says that she was enjoying watching all my valentine's day swaps and my swap is open to subscribers it was open to absolutely everybody and anybody and technically it wasn't even open to subscribers because i didn't even say that was one of the requirements so it was just open to everybody I am going to host again for Halloween and Christmas. Halloween is my favorite holiday and Christmas is Sunny's and my mom. So we do a lot of stuff for both. Technically, we do a lot of stuff for all holidays. Like today, I just put up all of our green decorations for St. Patrick's Day. My nails got painted green for St. Patrick's. So yes, we are just a bunch of holiday celebrating people. Anything to celebrate, we definitely do. So um, yes, so future swaps halloween and christmas i kind of wanted to do an embellishment box swap i was thinking maybe spring but i feel like that's too soon i don't know if i can get it together to have people enter or not so i might hold off on that and just stick to halloween and christmas but that just seems like such a big gap in between of doing swaps so I don't know we'll see if you guys have any recommendations let me know what you guys think and then moving on to wanda's happy mail here she sent me a cute little card right here and i absolutely love wanda we text and she was just thanking me for her friendship which i don't know why she's thanking me you know she's as good as a friend as you know anything so she's just an amazing person to know and let's see what we got so from the spoon i can kind of tell i think that she sent me some stamps some wax stamps so you guys know i love making those oh i was wrong <laughs> it's the wax seals which i love i made a bunch in blue silver and white last year for like a winter um little gift that i did so let's see what's in this one 
blue yes i love this blue and it's got like a metallic to it so it's so funny i literally have my wax seals right here in front of me and you can see i used up pretty much all of my blue right there because i was using the blue the silver and the whites right here and i used gold too in there and you can see i used some of the red over there so yes you see my little blue is empty and this looks like it actually matches perfectly with that so I love that. Thank you so, so much, friend. I absolutely can definitely use that because I love making wax seals. And then now I have an extra little spoon, which is awesome because you can never have enough spoons. I like having multiple of them um, burning at the same time. So I'll put the wax on here and then have it sitting on the little holder. And then, you know, I'll be pouring, you know, this one right here. And then, you know, this one's ready to go and kind of get like a little like assembly line going is what i usually do so i could get a bunch done all at one time so thank you so so much friend and um she sent this case right here as well so let's see what's over in here which i could kind of tell that it was halloween like i said is my favorite holiday so let's see what's in these drawers because i didn't take a peek i wanted to do it on camera Oh, we have little ghosties. Oh, I like these. Most little ghosties look like, you know, um, kind of like jolly and like character, like whimsical. So I like these. That These look like a little bit more mean face ghosts. So I love that. Now my wax is going to fall. There we go. And then, um, oh, we got some witches hats. That's cool. You can never have enough little witch hats. Oh, and I like that these are... Thin too so these are going to be good for embellishments or memory decks i definitely want to start making more memory decks so this will be perfect for that i don't tend to do very chunky um like embellishments and projects so i like the thinner stuff oh we got some more hats down here and some pumpkins i think some more of those little witches hat these are going to be really cute add some glitter put like a little flower right there that'd be really cute oh yes yeah. see and then we have some pumpkins these are cute i like that they are not typical all orange pumpkins and that these are black with orange so that is really nice i like the non-normal stuff so love that thank you so so much amiga i really really appreciate it like I said, no need to thank me for our friendship. I appreciate you. And I can't wait for us to meet one day. I know one day soon we'll be able to hang out. So, all right, guys, that is it for this little happy mail video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you to everybody that watches. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. And we'll see you later. Bye, guys.